Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share today's channeled message from the Divine Collective and your Divine Counterpart. And it's so lovely because I had the number 88, 88, 88 in my head. So it is. You are the one, the one that I want to grow old with, the one that I want to be with when we are sharing stories of our lives together, sitting by an open fire, doing life together and just being together. I've never felt like this before about anyone. And that's how I know that you're the one. You're different. You complete me in ways I didn't even know needed completing. I want to do all my adventures with you. My soul is yearning to be in your arms, to feel our bodies wrapped around each other, to feel the eternal flame of desire ignite between us, to feel real passion, to be deliriously in love with no fear, no doubt. I want to give you all of me every day, forever. Oh, well, again, I mean, that's just so lovely because, again, that's so in keeping. If you um, followed the energy read that I did this morning, it was all about them wanting to be able to say how they feel, but not being able to. But I think they just have. So again, just a beautiful message and what they want to say is that you are the one and they want to grow old with you and they want to give you all of them every day forever, which is just a beautiful message again. So if you would like to have a channeled message for yourself, it's only $10. And um, I basically tap into your energies and then just write whatever I hear and they are you know every single one is just amazing and I keep getting so many lovely emails from people saying I keep using the book like the oracle I hear a number and then I check in the book and it answers the question that I'm just needing right at that moment and that is what is so lovely because that is the exact purpose of the book you know, the purpose of doing this and the reason why I was guided to do it was to really, really help you on your journey, right? It's all about bringing you into the vibe of unconditional love, tapping into that divine collective energy, being able to get my messages directly from your twin soul. So to help you on your path, because it is, you know, you're navigating so many crazy energies, right? And it's really difficult to say, you know, sometimes it's kind of you have to own your own stuff. And so that's why being able to ride those waves and, you know, using, using this to tap into that divine collective energy, which is the purest energy of divine love. And that's what will help you on your path. So if you'd like to have a channeled letter, if you'd like to come to me for a healing or reading, I'm doing healings tomorrow because it is the 1st of the 11th, which is 1, 1, 1. So I've um, been guided to do the healings that I've got tomorrow. So if you've booked in, then you will get your write-up tomorrow. Um, but it is all about, you know, really trusting in this incredible journey that you're on into more love. And really, know, really thinking, you know, this is, you're also a way... You're paving the way for a new generation, right? That are going to take, you're handing over the baton. And so that's why if you are in ever any doubt, right? You just have to think of the bigger picture. And that's why it's been so lovely channeling letters for your children and your future children and seeing those messages come through. Because again, it just puts that context around actually what we're here to do. And the, this grounding of this amazing, you know, rainbow energy and the, you know, all of the, you know, the messages from the children are very much about rainbows, um, rainbow prisms of light and, you know, rainbow palaces. And there's been lots of like rainbow, you know, rainbow references. And so it just, again, makes you realize that there is such an amazing, you know, movement that you're part of into more love and so that's why if you take yourself out of your individual situation and move yourself into the bigger picture um, then that will help you so much more on your journey because 
if you get embroiled in your stuff it makes it very hard to see it the light at the end of the tunnel if you